walking, even standing up. A few months ago, Hassan was unable to do any of that. The 10-year-old boy weighed just 9 kilos. Many thought he was not going to survive. Until a charity offered to cover all expenses to transfer the boy to a hospital in the capital, Sana'a. Now, weighing just over 13 kilos, Hassan is slowly getting back on his feet. But his health remains fragile. Because of the war, the boy and his family have been displaced several times. Now they live in Hadja, one of the poorest regions in the country. Here, severe shortages are the norm, especially food. Meals often consist of bread and rice. As a result, Hassan needs more treatment and makes regular trips to a medical center. <laughs> The six-year-old war in Yemen has pushed some 30 million people to the brink of starvation. The UN says it's the largest humanitarian crisis in the world. A crumbling economy, fuel shortages and the coronavirus pandemic have only made it worse. And children are bearing the brunt of the crisis. According to UNICEF, in Yemen, some 98,000 children under the age of five are severely malnourished and need urgent treatment. A 15 percent increase compared to last year.